Here are some highlights of Kava Release 1.35.1. A new crash barrier shape and standard was added. The shape ODB 2021 for the front as used in UNECE R94 can be selected in the standard combo box. The shape parameters can be displayed and if needed can be adjusted in the configuration file. After choosing the positioning option, the crash barrier and the vehicle touch point will be displayed. For number plates a new detail check for the front was added. It will check if the horizontal and vertical tilt of the plate is within the allowed tolerance limit. In addition Kava will check if the view on the number plate is unobstructed from within the required angle range. In an update to Euro NCAP and UNECE R17 regulations a new method to calculate the backset of the head to the headrest was introduced. The backset is now measured as horizontal line distance from the back of the head of the torso link. This method and updated torso link parameters are included in the new standards. A new function to check the monitor position of camera monitor system was added. Based on input of the monitor surface and reference point, Kava will validate if the view angle to the monitor position is within allowed horizontal and vertical angle range. To assess the reflection due to diffuse ambient light, the direct and mirrored isotropy range pyramids are created. Together with the Kava function, camera field of view, this facilitates measurement of the pyramid's ratio of projected area leaving the vehicle. In Camera Field of View, the definition of LiDAR cameras have been improved. The light source position can now have a positive or negative offset from the rotation axis. Head-up display overlays are now regulated as view obstructions in area S as defined in UNECE R125 Revision 3. These overlays are usually represented as a floating surface of the virtual picture where it appears to the driver. Kava will now also consider such elements in front of area S for the obstruction check. A new A-pillar covering standard SAEJ1050 was added. If selected, the obstruction angle is calculated considering eye ellipses using methods relative to neck point or closest point. In Kava Safety, the Pedestrian Protection Standard UNECE R127 Revision 3 was updated to the latest version. This reflects the new rear limit definition of the cowl area and special cases for the corners of the windscreen test area. Also for the windscreen test area there are now options to split the zone in equal thirds and to add explicit grid points. In the safety radius check, now measurements of projecting height values for points close to gaps are created automatically and displayed in the violated points list. Also for all interactive checkpoints, the projecting height measurements are displayed in the feature tree and in the section viewer. After interactive inspection, now there is a possibility to manually mark the violated point status as valid or invalid. The new Kava section radius check function can be used to detect radius and convexity violations on section curves of aerodynamic surfaces or functional parts for motorsport specific regulations. Configurations for selected areas of current FIA F1 regulations are included. Standards can be configured to contain convex and concave minimum radius limits and define the section direction. As a result Kava provides the section geometry and the curve segments violating the regulation. An interactive check is included to show measured radius values along the cross sections. 
check the Kava README for a complete list of updated standards and regulations. Thank you for watching the Kava 1.35.1 What's New video. If you want to learn more about Kava, visit the Technia website or contact us.